All right, so today we're going to show you the new Evergreen water meter. Um, we're going to set a pump with it real quick just to kind of give you an idea of how it works. So I have it hooked up. Uh, my high side, my low side, my blue hose. Uh, I got them directly off the pump. Both my valves are open at the moment, so we're going to bleed water through it using our, uh, our purge high and our purge low. So we purged our water, purged our low side. So the Evergreen has two neat features when you zero it. You can zero it to atmosphere, which is similar to when you close your valves on your short ridge and open up your vent, or you can actually zero to your high side. And so we're going to start by zeroing the atmosphere. We're going to close both of our hoses off 100% so that there's no new water entering our meter. We're going to purge both sides, and we're going to go into our evergreen. We're going to go to options, and you see that there's a differential uh, pressure to atmosphere. We're going to pick that one, select, and so you'll see that now the meter says zero prep. We're going to go back over here, swift this valve to uh, equalize zero. Once it does that, you'll notice that the evergreen says it's zeroing. So you'll start seeing it creep down to 0, 0.00. Once it gets there, we'll hit the select button. It'll close everything out. We'll go ahead and put our meter back to how it should be. Close off our bypass. Open up our high side, vent it, close it. Open up our low side, vent it, close it off. And so now we're reading differential pressure. The neat thing about the Evergreen is we're reading it in PSI on the top, feet on the bottom. So we're going to go ahead and set the pump, uh, deadhead it. I'll record it and I'll show you how that works. So we'll deadhead the pump. We'll hit the S button for save. We'll open the pump back up. And so you can see here that this is a live shot, but if we scroll over, you can see reading number one, we're at 60 foot ahead on the pump. So same thing the Evergreen does neat is you can actually zero to your low side. So if you have, uh, you've gone through 20, 30 valves, and for some reason you're not getting back to zero whenever you open up your bypass. So I'll show you what that looks like. If you open up your, your bypass on your meter, you should see something like zero PSI. So whenever you're going through a bunch of valves, you start changing your hoses, you lose a little bit of water, stuff changes on your system, you want to re-zero it. So the way that the Evergreen works is you're gonna close off uh, one of your, your, your high side hose, your actual valve on the front of the hose. You're going to open up your uh, equalize. And so what that does is you now have uh, constant pressure in your meter and it's only coming from your low side. And so you can see here that we have 15.7 PSI and 36.3 foot. Uh, 36.2 on our other one though, so we're gonna go into options again. This time we're gonna go to differential only. So we're gonna select that, and we'll flip our switch to put it into zeroing mode. And you'll see that it'll actually trim off just a little bit off of your, your high side hose and give you a zero Point zero, and so once that's done, we're gonna watch this 0 0.1 psi should go to 0, 0.0 like it just did. We're gonna save that. Once it goes back, now we're reading 0, 0.0. That's how you zero out your evergreen water.